Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying Hue. Uh, it says, get back to human, chocolate covered hunks. I have the cashews and vanilla bean. And I have sour golden berries. These were $4.99 each at the Fresh Market. They might have these at Whole Foods, but I only recall seeing them at the Fresh Market. They also sell Hue uh, candy bars, which we've never tried. So we're, we'll try these first and see what we think. These are vegan, paleo, no shiny glaze, it says. Yeah, there's, they're right about it. it how it's like kind of a gross thing. It's gross. Let's see. Chocolate covered snacks always struck us as bizarrely shiny. Something weird must be added, we'd say. We were right. Confectioner's Glaze, or shellac, gives chocolate covered snacks their appetizing sheen. This glaze is on almost every chocolate covered goodie, but most people don't realize it's usually a chemically treated insect goo. Google it, kind of gross. Goo. Hugh avoids weird ingredients like confectioner's glaze and embraces unadulterated chocolate. Um, let's see. Of course, you can make cho chocolate glaze shiny too, but. Yeah, we use, uh, for our bourbon balls, we, what do we, wax. we use wax. Yeah, we just use wax. It's delicious. Um, so, um, this is a no shiny glaze, no refined sugar, no cane sugar, no sunflower. Uh, le lectin, no dairy, gluten, no palm oil, no sugar alcohols, no soy, lectin, there's that word again. Um, so these are one ounce, 28 grams, 170 calories. Vegan and paleo. And they have a, uh, it says check out our paleo inspired Hugh Kitchen restaurant. Yeah, they have a, a restaurant. What were they made? Did you just say where they were made? Um, no, I think they're, for some reason I'm thinking they're in New, yeah, New yeah, York. Yeah. yeah, and it's HughKitchen.com, and they, yeah, they are in New York. So these are the cashews and vanilla bean. Not a good vanilla at all. But I do get the salty cashew underneath. And it's a darker chocolate. It's Yes, it's dark chocolate. It's like cocoa. Yes. That's what it tastes like. It tastes mm -hmm. like cocoa. Like baking cocoa. I do get vanilla. I get cocoa and vanilla. I think they I probably... Touch of vanilla, yeah. I think they probably had to add that vanilla to give it some kind of... To take something away from that cocoa because the cocoa is so dark and strong. Mm -hmm. Um... Did you taste the cashew? Yeah, I got some cashew. Did you? And a little salt. For me, the, the cocoa is so strong. Yeah. Um, I don't mind it. Mm -mm. It's not. It's too dark for me. I wouldn't sit there and just eat them. Right. Um, but but, I, would, but I wouldn't mind them if somebody had them out. Maybe that would keep you from eating a lot, is it being so dark. It would you, definitely keep you from eating. It would curb your appetite. Because um, I've eaten like two or three and I'm pretty much done. Right. <laughs> so, okay, so these... Which is a shame. I, li I like the cashews. I just, I think it's too dark for me. These are, and that's okay. These are sour golden berries. They are, it says, one ounce, 28 grams, 130 calories. Mm. They smell good. They're shaped. Mm. Yeah, they smell really good. Look like little meteors. <laughs> When Tammy takes a picture of these, you'll see, don't those look like little meteors? They need to be flying in space. They do. Chewy texture. They're very, very tart. Get very ready. Tart. Oh, you got it? Mm-hmm. I mean... Wow. I mean... I mean fuck her up. Tart to the extreme. Mm -hmm. Like on a level of one to ten, that is a ten on the tartness scale. Yeah, yeah that's again. I, I, the chocolate was better, but I wouldn't want that. I personally thing. could not eat that. Yeah, it's too, want. it's too tart for me. I, I, I can't, I can't. That do tastes it. like one of those berries that's warning you don't eat me. Yeah, I'm, you're I'm not poison. Don't eat me. I'm sour. <laughs> <laughs> Please don't pick me. Leave me alone. Um, yeah, that uh, I could not eat that. Um, out of it the has two, a, the aftertaste is almost. Almost raisin-like, 
-hmm. Just a little bit, but it's, it's still got that sour bitterness just hanging around my mouth. It too. is over the top. That is probably one of the hardest things I've ever had. Mm -hmm. That's how tart it is. It's, I mean, and you're talking as far as about natural things. Even it, candies and stuff like that that they are supposed to be tart that uh, they say are. Warheads are pretty dark. I think those are tarter than a warhead. They're pretty dark. To me, those are. Yeah, and that's saying a lot. So if you've ever had a warhead candy, those are tarter to me than a warhead. It's, got, it's up there. I could eat a warhead sooner than I could eat another one yeah. of those. That's how tart that was. I, I don't even want one. No, I don't want um, one. Either. So <laughs> I think the quality's there. I yeah. really do think that these are made with care and quality. It's just not something for us. Yes, yeah. they, they went the... Um, different route mm -hmm. and, and made them things that are different mm -hmm. and for us they're just too different right <laughs> so i um, think the cashews would have been awesome if they put that that chocolate that was in the the berries uh -huh. they use that kind of chocolate on the cashews that would have been better you know there was so much tartness in that berry really that i just I, I couldn't even fo i couldn't even focus on the yeah chocolate. well I, least, I didn't at and least i'm not willing to eat another one dark chocolate flavor um I know, I'm wondering if you could get just the piece of chocolate. There's no way. There's no way you could, no. I don't think. There's, and I'm, I can't, no. <laughs> uh, so, um, as far as their candy bars, their chocolate bars, what I would have to do is I would, I haven't actually picked them up to look at what flavors they had. I would have to um, look at the flavors and I would have to seriously consider it. So, if they said um, that they put it in a dark chocolate, uh, or well it says on the back it says organic cacao if it said organic cacao on their chocolate bars i would not buy it because i know that that it, i would just be wasting my money mm -hmm. uh because just like with these these were five dollars a bag we will not eat either one of these um so i would not try their candy bars based on that now if they if if I go next time we're at the fresh market, I'll look. And so if they have like milk chocolate, something like that, I will. I would definitely be willing to give that a try. But just the um, the organic cacao, it is so dark, and I just know it's not going to be something that I'm going to enjoy. You know, when I have a dessert, I want to enjoy it and not feel like I'm suffering. With these, I feel like it's. Um, I'm suffering a little bit. I yeah. feel like I'm being like punished. Yeah, but if you like something really, really sour and tart, you'll you might love that something yeah. different. You know. Yeah. So I hope you enjoyed the video and getting to see these. Uh, I'll have a picture for you at the end. And thanks for watching.